I'm Nell Sanders, and this is Tell It Like It Is, where all things controversial are covered. Since December 2015, the Northampton City Council has been meeting to discuss the 51 refugees that are relocating to our community within the year. Now, this all came about because the City Council decided on a refugee resolution that declared Northampton a sanctuary for all refugees fleeing the Syrian crisis. Refugees will be resettled by January 2017 and are relocating from places like Syria, Burundi, and the Congo. Meetings took place last week on Mondays and Thursdays. Now, the topic of refugees is pretty touchy and raises the question of safety and morality. So I decided to interview NHS students on their opinions on the 51 refugees and the Syrian case as a whole. Can you state your name and grade? I'm Alex Cotter. I'm in 12th grade. Jesse Zeldes. I'm a junior. I'm Isaac Bond. I'm a sophomore. I'm Gabe Broder. I'm also a sophomore. Uh, Willow Zadwarney. I'm a junior. Uh, Lily. I'm a junior. So we are accepting 51 refugees into our town over the next year. Do you think that number is too big or too small? I mean, my first instinct is to say that number is too small because I think the U.S. should be doing a lot more to accept refugees. Uh, the EU has been accepting tons of refugees for a long time, and I think it's important that we sort of play our part, especially with all the military action the U.S. is taking in the Middle East. I think we could always accept more, but it also depends on what resources we have. I don't think that there can be a number that's too big because we need to help these people, we need to bring them in. Do you think the U.S. has a moral obligation to accept refugees or is that an unsafe measure? Yeah, no, I think it's a moral obligation. Like, uh, perhaps not specifically in Syria, but a lot of conflict in the Middle East has been caused, and even the conflict in Syria arguably has been caused by U.S. intervention in the area. I think America should be a place where people should feel safe to come to. They seem pretty chill. Doesn't seem like a lot of harm could happen, so what's, what's the harm? I do not think we are morally obligated to take in refugees because it's not a direct it's not a direct concern of us. It's like in Europe, they are literally bordering like Turkey and all those areas, so they go right into the country, whereas we we have a process, and I don't really believe that we need to get ourselves involved in other people's business. So what do you think about the 51 refugees? Let me know. Again, I'm Nell Sanders, and this was Tell It Like It Is.